How about now? Um, I, I'm, I'm worried about the echo. Just a high pitch ring. Hello. It's good. Sound good. Sound good. Okay. All right. I'm so sorry about that. Uh, I, I do apologize. Okay. So, uh, I got a lot of things. No echo. Okay. Awesome. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Um, I have three screens in front of me and every time I think I'm used to it, if I wait a little, I just, it's not fully integrated into my like muscle memory yet. Um, it's a bit low. Okay. That I can, that I can do something about. Um, let me try this. How about now? Is that any better? Is that any better? Um, I can't hear myself at all. Hey, Ruth is here. That's cool. Oh, that's my fan. Oh, my fan. Okay, I'm going to turn the fan off. I'll be right back. I put it on its lowest setting because I need some air. <laughs> <laughs> right? Okay, what's worse? <laughs> Yay, thumbs up. Yay. All right. Yes. Um oh, that reminds me. I found a new I found um Okay, we're going to use a new giveaway tool and I forgot to integrate it. We we figured out a new giveaway tool. I forgot to integrate it today. So, um don't turn off the fan, she says. Hi, Sabrina. Hi, Carrie. Okay, everything is perfect. Okay, that's great. Good to hear, except for this. That's not perfect, but that's okay. <laughs> Yay! Okay, so it's going to be an interesting night. I I loaded a lot of things. In, oh, look at this. Here's a sneak peek. I found this out the other day. I went, um, hi, Carol. I, uh, I, this is like 1920s, 1930s Navajo. And I found it the other day. I went out, um, you know, to another antique center kind of place with Maria. And I found this and I couldn't believe what they were asking for it and I got a little discount and um and it's one of I think this is the best bracelet I've ever found I've always wanted one um and so I like I can't believe that I found this <laughs> and that's coming up not in Sunday's video but in the Sunday after this Sunday and um, I'll probably, I haven't decided what I'm doing with it yet. I might sell this, honestly. I might not. I might upgrade to this and sell another piece from my collection, as we all do. Also, Rob said he likes this, and he can wear this, too. So, you know, why not, right? Um, okay, so let's show you the, uh, this. This is how it works here. Let me get it over. All right, so that right there is the QR code for the shop, Hudson Vintage. I have a shop. If you've ever seen the videos, if you've seen uh, like the toolkit, oh, someone just got something. <laughs> Thank you, yeah, you gotta be quick here. I, there were some pre-sales. I loaded, um, I, I loaded like almost 40 things and there were already some pre-sales Okay, um, but there's still a lot left. Um, yeah, I know. Upgrade to that. Hey, Tara. Hi. Um, I saw the texting and I couldn't get to it because I was using my phone to load everything. But I saw what was going on with you. Good to see you. Good to see you here. Um, Marion's here. Patty's here. <laughs> it can't be sold out already. Let me check the store. No, there's still many. Yeah, there's still a whole bunch of stuff. I, I, I loaded a lot of earrings. There were still a lot of earrings. And um, some of those were really, really nice for the money. Well, they were all nice for the money. Actually, all of them. 
but some of them were like $70. So that's pretty cool. But anyway, if you want to check, if you want to get ahead of line, if you want to get ahead in the line, right, um, check that. And you can go through everything that I loaded today. And I'm just going to hold things up as they sell or hopefully before they sell. <laughs> and um, I, there's also, I, I can start going over things. Okay, um, you can scan the QR code on your screen. This is the first thing I'm going to show. All right, and that is this. I picked this up in Nevada City. It's inscribed um, with a date of 1964. And, oh, somebody, yeah, you guys are getting stuff. You're getting ahead of the line. So that's really beautiful. The inscription is really beautiful. Okay, that's um, how it looks sort of on the finger. It's a long marquee. It's 14 karat gold. So that's available. Um, the turtles are still here. That's the back. This is the front. I have two of these. Hi, Eileen. I have two of these. These are actually the person I, the estate that I got these from, she was a stylist and she had three of these and three of the cone flowers. And I know that she wore them clustered. Um, but there's two now if you want to, oh, let me put the QR code up. Yeah, so you can scan that and it's also in the chat. You can see right there in the chat, it says check rhinestone turtle pin, $45. If you click on that, you don't even have to be signed into YouTube. The great thing about shopping here on NSN is that you don't have to be signed in to YouTube. You can... Um, you know, move your pointer to the link in the chat and just click on it and go straight there. And it opens up as a web page. It's a, it's my shop. It's a, it's, um, it's HudsonVintageFinds.com, right? So you can just go straight there and, um, and it's pretty cool that way. So anyway, so those are available. And then also, um, these three are still available as well, and um, I'm thinking about taking them out of the shop because I like the idea of wearing them on a blazer in a cluster that makes that shape. Oh, I can't do it. Um, I, can, I can't do it on my shoulder, but I can show you. See that kind of shape? Look how great, oh yeah, look. Like that's the, oops. <laughs> That's the way to do it. <laughs> so, um, so those are there. I'm just kind of, you know, reviewing. I'm just, and now uh, that I don't have with me. This I have. This is gorgeous. Oh, I need my neck. I left it where I was taking the pictures. One second. Okay, this is really lovely. This is not signed, but look how nice this is. This chunky link, this is a really wonderful quality. All right, and it's that old gold patina and it's got that like organic bark texture or hashtag texture. This is so nice. I'm sure it's high end. I can't, uh, I cannot attribute it. Okay. All right, let's see what you guys are getting. Let's see what you're getting. Um, and I will hold it up. Okay, somebody got... Oh, the painter's palette, yes. Okay, this is wonderful. This is gold filled. Look how beautiful that is. That's gold filled and it's also a pendant. There's the bail. Okay, so it's a it's like a, you can hang it from a chain, pin pendant, and you also get the earrings. And these, I would say, 1930s, 1940s. Look how beautiful, old gold filled. And it's a very pink gold. 
All right, so you somebody got that, and then the oh, and then somebody got just now the oh, the cross. Oh, well, it's sort of a cross, it's sort of not a cross. This amazing thing, look how cool that is. That's a pool of light in there, that's actually a real pool of light rock quartz, double terminated. Okay, you get that and the ring. All right, so nice job on that one. And uh, let's see what else. Um, <laughs> somebody got something for... Uh, oh, the Ralph Lauren earrings. Those are so pretty. Okay, these are gone. These turned out to be Ralph Lauren. They're crystal, but that is um, a stone. That is a gemstone. It's some kind of... Uh, agate or quartz and uh, let's see if I can figure this out the next is that it is that everything oh somebody got the uh, the lever backs the lever backs are so nice those are gone I'll show those and then um, we'll start just showing better things that are still available. Look how nice these are. These are so old school, like you don't see anymore. These are 14 karat lever backs with emeralds and sapphires. Okay. There's sapphire ones. This is so nice. Okay. And the emeralds are awesome. They're, they're very nice old emeralds. You can see that like silk in them. They're not totally opaque. Those That was good. That was a good thing. All right, so let's go with what we... Let's start with... Uh, let's go down to the bottom of the list. Okay, so here's the things I added today. I'm starting with the things I added today. All right, first thing is this. This is brand new today. This I got in Nevada City. This is old coral. <laughs> Hi, Dale. We do love the lurkers. Oh, wow, 131 people here already. Okay, so I'm going to do a giveaway at the end of the night everybody. I'm going to do a random giveaway. You are going to win cash for being here. Maybe I will ha be able to use the new tool that we integrated. If not, I will use my phone. Look how pretty that is. That's old Coro. It's signed. Okay. It's in perfect condition. Has the tassel hang tag, the old Coro script. It's got that Florentine texture. Really, really cool, all right? And it's adjustable. So nice old vintage piece there. See the Florentine? And the length on it is coming right up. Um, 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 um. It's adjustable. So it goes from 14 to 16 inches 14 to 16 inches okay it's really really pretty all right we have that that was new today and then oh these i love these where did i put them ah oh, i love these okay so these came from the estate of the lady that had the boutique right uh yeah so take a look at these i feel like i could have brought these to auction honestly they're really designer 80s couture um, they're super comfortable. They're not too heavy. All right. Look how cool. I mean, honestly. I mean, okay, I'm wearing silver, but there you go. Fantastic. And not too much. Like, just so great. All right. So those are new today. That one, that's gone. This is interesting. I made this $25. I didn't know what this was. And um, you guys commented and said that it could be like um, a, a memory, uh, a memento mori, like a memory thing or a grieving thing. The little black heart does open, all right? I have not opened it, but it does twist open. 
And that's like a Dalmatian Jasper uh, quartz uh, point. So I thought that it was more, you know, I thought that it was something else, right? I, I thought that it was like a more new age kind of thing, but I thought the bottle was so pretty, you know, the faceted black heart. So I made it twenty five dollars. I didn't. I didn't know what else. You know, it's not sterling. It's just this interesting thing. These I love, 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 love. Oh, if you want to request anything, I can see your comments. So if you want, if you want to browse and you want me to hold it up, let me know. Just be aware that then everybody can see it and it could go very fast. All right. Um, so the, I, I really love these. <laughs> I just really love them. There's a close-up of the mark. These are sterling. This is a sterling fork and spoon. Okay. And it's, it's, it does have some age to the sterling. Um, but I think it adds to the charm. So you can see like the back of the spoon. You could polish that. But why? Why would you? Isn't that awesome? Look at it. I mean, if you love to cook or if you know, like even a man could wear, you know how they were, all the men are wearing pins now, like from the Oscars, you know, all the men are, it's like, I love when they do that. That was a thing back in the eighties. Men wore, wore pins all the time and then it kind of stopped. My ex-husband used to wear a, a wooden dog from the 1940s on his jacket and it looked so great. Anyway, look how cool that is. I mean, they're cool. And they're they're really like little pieces of silverware. <laughs> I just love them. <laughs> okay, uh, so that's available. The Trafari, fantastic. Where, where did I put that? Here it is. It's this shape. This is the one I found at Five Acres, I think. Look how beautiful that is. This is a good one. This is a really nice old one. This is adjustable also. Um, I mean, just look at it. Like they don't, they just don't make them like that anymore. It looks like fine jewelry, right? It's old Trafari. So this is without the adjustable chain link, 13 inches, and then it goes up to 16 with the chain link. All right. And look how it reads. It reads like a, like a really special modern Omega. All right, really cool. And that's probably, I don't know, it's from the 50s. So it's old and it looks like that. It's not gonna stop looking like that. Like it's really high quality. Then these are gone. Those are gone. How can I see this on YouTube on my TV? Oh, hi Lisa, I wish I knew. I'm not good with how devices work. Like I use my notebook all the time. And um, I know that there's a lot of people that watch on television. So maybe somebody can tell you in the chat. Let's see. Somebody just got something. I will hold it up. Oh, the ruby studs. Yeah, those were really pretty rubies. I, I thought those would go first. I will show you those. Uh, let me find them. Are they in there? I put them someplace. Special. There's some really nice blue topaz that, oh, I added the jade is so good. Is that the rubies? No, that's the sapphire. Where are they? Why did I leave them all in the bags? That was, here they are. These are nice. These are nice. They're not totally opaque. All right. This is also like what you don't see anymore. Somebody got the pigeon blood. They're, 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 they look like small stones, but for stud earrings, not so much. And for, look, rubies, not, look, old ruby color. All right, how cool is that? Vintage ruby color. Somebody snagged those. The Sea Wonders. Uh, oh, those might be gone. Uh, oh, oh, somebody got this. That's gone. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm so glad you could appreciate it. I wasn't sure if I should do it or not, but I thought it was so interesting and cool. Um, and then, oh, 
Oh, it's like this. Okay. That was the rubies. Oh, somebody got both pairs. Yes. I bet I know who you were. I can't tell, but I have a feeling. <laughs> okay. Check this out. These are great. Uh, it's going it's going by so fast again. I swear I cannot load enough. I really need help. <laughs> I really need help. Ah, okay. And I'm doing this again. Danny and I are doing spring fling on Sunday, everybody. We'll be back. Oh, these are great. Okay, so these are still here. I thought about keeping these. Let me show you these. Hold on. Let me get to them. While they're still here. Scarab, yes. Oh, that's okay. Wait until you see these. I thought about keeping these. These are a good price, too. And then this is one of the pairs of the blue topaz that somebody snagged already. Look how nice. Look, look at the construction. Okay, those were great. Um, but these are still here. Look at the back. That's 14 karat gold. I think these were made in Asia. Right, like the way that they were made, and they are exactly like the black onyx. Um, look how good carved, they're tiger eye carved into scarabs. A lot of gold, these are really cool. And now, and I don't, I, I, I know that you guys know, I know this audience is very smart, but I just want to say it out loud anyway. This is not small for a stud. Imagine if that was a diamond. All right, that's what studs do. So anyway, so that's still available. And then those are gone. Those were so good. The jade. I Oh, no, let me check. There was just an order. Uh, somebody got the sapphire studs. Those were, oh, those were marked European. Those were marked uh, 585 for European, 14 karat. Those were good. Um the apple jade. This is truly apple jade. Where did I put it? Here it is. Wait until you see these live. Get ready if you want these. Scan it or 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 get ready to hit it in the chat. Hit that link. These are true green apple jade. Testing is jadeite, everybody. Look at them. There's the back. This is the gemstone gem. All right. That's the bezel setting. And look, little detail. High, high quality. High quality. Look at it. All the way back here. Nice little jade earrings. Okay, good old jade. 14 carat. And then these are gone. And hold on, my, my supervisor. Oh, uh, I don't remember. Sunday, I think we're starting at 3. I think we're starting at 3. Let me ask Danny. I can't remember. It's the record light. <laughs> the record light makes everything, like, if it's not written down in, right in front of me, good luck, Don. Okay. What time Sunday? Is it three? Come on and say hi. She might be able to, she might not. I don't know. All right. So she's going to write back anyway. Oops. All right. Let me check the new orders. It's going so fast. Guys, it's only 730. <laughs> Oh, the jade! You got the jade! Oh, congratulations! They're so good. You're good. They're treasures. Those are little treasures. Those are top drawer in the jewelry box. Seriously. All right. Uh, oh, that was probably from Danny. Yeah. Three. Okay. 3 p.m. Pacific time. Oh, Pacific time. Pacific. All right. Okay, let's see what else 
new order. That was for the, oh, somebody got the flower, hi <laughs> Nancy. Somebody got the flower mirror pendant, cool, very pretty. Yeah, that's very fun. Um, all right, I think that's it. Okay, so now I can keep going. All right, oops, sorry, didn't mean to hit the mic. Did you guys just hear that? Uh, 3 p.m. Pacific is 3, 4, 5, it's 6 p.m. my time, right. I knew it was earlier. That's why my brain... Look at that thing. All right. Uh, these are gone. These were so nice. So nice. This is... Uh, this group, again, today is from the jewelry store that closed in the 1980s. Uh, oh, these are uh, 14 karat gold and CZ. These were a good deal. Those were a good, why did it go away? Oh, there it is. Okay. All right. Um, those were a good deal. No backs on those, but it doesn't matter. Uh, oh, somebody got the, the really big, fabulous pearl baubles. Those are awesome. Yes, you will love those. And... Uh, I just asked Danny to come in and she's not answering me. <laughs> I think that means she's busy. <laughs> okay. All right. We will be on together on Sunday, though. We're going to be doing spring fling on Sunday. Um, 6 o'clock my time, 3 o'clock her time. Hi, Susan. 5 Central. Yes. Warm greetings to all from Tampa. Yay. Thank you, Lisa. Yes, warm greetings as well, everyone. I like that. That's a very nice thing to say to a group. Greetings, everyone. These. 14 karat gold, $65. Are these still available? If they are, you should snag them. These have their backs. These are uh, a nice size. These are, you know, the uh, the seven to seven and a half. These have their backs. These are good old Akoyas. Okay. See those? On 14 karat gold. Seven to seven and a half. Classic pearl. You know, the job interview or the gym pearl, right? There they are. Perfect white color. That contrasts with the other ones. Okay, let me show you the other ones. The other ones are uh, more of like a champagne color. Those are Akoya as well, and they're smaller. Let's see if I can find those. Sapphire stud. Oh, those are the small ones. Okay, those are the smaller ones. There, there's these. There's a whole bunch of these that are such a good deal. Look at these. No, those are, yes, those are, I don't know, I'm confused. Anyway, it says in the description, I can't see it now, but it says in the description, champagne color. All right, you can tell that they have the champagne undertone. See that? See how nice? That's something people really look for. You know if you're one of those people that you look for that. All right, and the other ones were more like the traditional uh, white, pink white. Okay. And then... Are things not showing up on my list again? The white gold and smoky quartz. That's here. I can show that. Did it get did they get broken up? Huh. Let me get my bearings here. Sapphire studs. Yeah, okay. That is not, though, those are the ones that are gone already in the gold. 
here we go. This is the group that I wanted to get to. So there's a whole bunch. I'm just going to flash them. There's a whole bunch of little 14 karat gold studs for $70. Okay. There's these round blue topaz. There is the onyx. Look at the construction. That's like those were right next to the um, scarabs and, you know, the way the construction the consigner had them, so I'm sure that they are they were in the same family. And then uh, these, all right, these are ovals, blue topaz, seventy dollars. Whole whole little group that are just seventy dollars. Like you can't go wrong. These are actually not gemstone. These are crystal in fourteen karat gold. Okay, and here's what these look like. All right. Something like this they made at the time because there were people, uh, there are people, I should say, that can only wear 14 karat gold, right? And so this is a way, like, this is as close as you can get to fun jewelry if you can only wear 14 karat gold. They're little uh, crystals on, uh, like, a bauble, a bauble on a 14 karat gold post, Okay. And then, uh, oh, there, those are the champagne ones. All right, those are the champagne ones that I showed you. Let, you know what? Let me hold those up so you can see the difference. This is actually good value, right? If you're here to learn, I mean, I always, you know, you don't have to be a shopper if you just want to learn. You, I always try, or I should say, I always include something of value for the people that are here just to learn, right? So I will show you now. Those are the champagnes, okay? And let me get the, uh, everything's so, so delicate. It's fine jewelry. Fine jewelry is a whole different animal. So I will show you the difference, okay? One and one. And you should really be able to see it. See the difference in the tone? That's natural. They're a Koya. All right? And there you go. And I will, I have cleaned them since that picture was taken, so not to worry. All right. What's up over here? Oh, this. Okay, so this. Uh, I bought this on a hunch. Hold on. I don't want to mix these up. These are the ones. Uh, hold on. Yes, okay. <laughs> the champagnes go in here. All right. Now, also, just to finish the thought, right? Here is the round CZ. I mean, round, no, round blue topaz. All right, I think those are gone. Those are the round ones. We have the ovals. Set in 14 carat. Okay. And we have the black onyx. I'm getting there. I'm getting to the bracelet. Here's the black onyx. Sit. And then there's the back. Lots of uh, 14 karat gold in there. Good construction. Look how cool. Okay. Now, this is very interesting to me. This I bought on a hunch. Um, I, I could recognize this. I saw this, uh, on an online auction and I recognized it. I recognized it by the construction and the maker and the way that the stones were channel set. Okay. So this is gold over sterling and those are diamonds. Okay. Now these are not the most expensive diamonds in the world. This is what was known 
in the industry in the department stores as bridge diamonds. This was bridge diamonds. All right, so yes, they do have sparkle. They are multi-cut. There are baguettes and rounds in there. They're channel set. And it's a beautiful, I mean, it's a tennis bracelet. You know what I mean? That's the way it looks. <laughs> it's, it's not going to look any sparklier than that. Like, that is as sparkly as these diamonds get. But they're real diamonds, channel set, baguettes and rounds. And that is gold over silver. All right. It's got the push-in clasp, very secure, and the figure eight. And if you've always wanted a diamond uh, tennis bracelet or if you want to give one as a gift, this is great. This is a really good value. These bridge diamonds like this today in Macy's are starting at six, starting at 600. Okay. So I did... I did make that a good a good price. And here here's what they look like up close. All right, that's that's a bridge diamond, everybody. You can see that it has a reflection. All right. But it's far from the super, super jemmy jemmy, you know, it's not an engagement diamond. Okay. So that's that. And let's see, somebody got something. Yeah, it does. No, no, there's a place for it. I mean, for sure. And it's a bracelet, you know. So, oh, somebody got the champagne Akoyas. Yeah, those were nice. Even the clutch backs on that was nice. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the Sea Wonders I can show. Did I show those yet? I think I was about to. And then uh, I got sidetracked. Here they are. These are beautiful. These came from last Sunday's video. That that mansion. Look how great. Sea Wonder. All right. Oh. There it is. They are signed. Oh, good for you, Melissa. Yeah, those are great. Those are really great. <laughs> I know. Every diamond needs a loving home. Yeah, and they're be I mean, they're beautiful. Like it's a beautiful piece of jewelry. Right? I just want you to know. And they're not promotional diamonds. Like, they're nice. Okay? Um, they're just... They just they're they bridge diamonds. That's what they are. They're bridge diamonds. There's all, they're all sorted together. There's no place where the eye sticks. You know? There you go. Super pretty. All right. Maria calls these dirty diamonds. <laughs> I love that. Okay, uh, uh, let's see, was there anything I didn't get to? I feel like that went by pretty fast. The sapphires are gone. Oh, the Smokies. All right, I'll show the Smokies. I think those are still available. And that's it. And then I can review the things from last week. These are smoky Quartz. These are not smoky Topaz. This is the only thing we have in white gold today. All right, I just put these out. White gold smoky quartz. Very nice. Much better. Oh. Where are they? No. Looking for them. Here they are. All right, these are 140. These look much better than in that picture. There they are. There they are. They do have presents. All right, beautiful smoky quartz in white gold. Nice construction. Nice little fine jewelry earrings. All right. Oh, see, Wonder is sold out. Somebody got the bracelet. I think somebody got the bracelet. Let's see. I think that was the only thing we had for 200. Yes, bracelet is gone. Yes, you will enjoy that. And it, you know what? You can wear it. You can wear it every day and not worry about it. You don't have to be too precious with it. It's a diamond line bracelet that you don't have to be too precious with. Okay. Uh, I will show some of the... Okay, that is gone. 
Oh, this is great, everybody. This is so great. This is still available. All right. Old box. Do you remember a hand in the chat if you saw this in that Sunday video where I went through the $20,000 with the, of, of things with the consigner? Do you remember that? This is what came out of there. This is ancient. The box is old. All right. If you don't want the box, let me know. I won't send you the box. But it kept everything inside it like new. That's sterling and rhinestone. How awesome is that? And it's got the old um, screw earrings. But that's sterling. All right. And let's see. Somebody got something. What'd you get? What'd you get? What'd you get? I try. I mean, I loaded so many things. It's like I never. Oh, the smoky quartz. Yeah, those were beautiful. Those were beautiful. Those were really. Those you'll wear a lot. Yeah. So it's something like that that you end up like using a lot. You know what I mean? Um, okay. And then the old Carl Art signed. All right. The pin and the earrings. And that's, okay, more value, right? If you are um, a vintage jewelry collector or you're learning to be a reseller or whatever, and you see that mark in jewelry, it's that same mark they put inside rings and things like that. Now you know. That's a carl art, okay? And then look how pretty. Also sterling, rhodium over sterling. Old, so old. I want to say 40s or earlier, okay? And that is this one. All right, there's a close-up of the pin. All right, why are we doing pink hands? Oh, hand in the chat. Because sometimes I say, like, you know, let me know. It's a way for me to know, like, who's here. You know what I mean? Because I, I asked, like, oh, if you are if you remember seeing it in the in that Sunday video, let me know. Hand in the chat. And then people just go, me, I do, I do. <laughs> this one, this came out of uh, that antique center that I went to with Maria. All right, this is marked 1976. I saw this in the museum. We did a field trip. I was 10. And it orients like that. You can tell how it orients because the pin you want to have straight, right? So you hold the pin straight, you put it on, and that's the angle. There it is right there. Okay, that's available. And what else? What else? Oh, I love these. How come I didn't pull these for myself when nobody got them? I was thinking about doing it. I put these on and they are really comfortable. I was surprised. Yeah. These, you don't even know you have them on. <laughs> I know it sounds ridiculous, but I'm, I'm, I'm telling the truth. You really, I don't even know I have them on. All right, so this is for real, guys. If you don't grab them tonight, I am taking them back. Look at them. They look good even with, like, you know, just a fun... Yeah, these are great. <laughs> I really like these. Okay, here they are up close. I'm not going to oversell these. I like these a lot. These are very high-end. All right, there they are. There's the back. All right, now you know. Now you know. You are informed. You are informed as a group. <laughs> oh, you want to, Oh. Are you trying to say, Jaren? Are you trying to say, uh, can you not get to it? All right. Let me see. I, I, I cannot take them out of inventory if you can't get to them right now. Somebody's having trouble getting in. Jaren? Wait, question mark. Now I'm typoing. She's typoing. I'm typoing. All right. Yes. Okay. All right. So if they're still there, if they're still there, okay. All right. <laughs> How come you can't get them? <laughs> you should be anybody can click on anything in the shop. All right. Um, this. This is super special. This is sterling. That's the back. 
This is the front. Oh, I think somebody just grabbed them. Look. Has that optical quality in the sterling around the face. That's glass. There's the mark. And this is this is special. All right. I have no idea how old this is. Um, I just know that it's good. Just gonna put it on a, a torque here. Oh, that's a little thick. Hold on. I need a different torque. Oh, maybe I'll put it on this. <laughs> yes. Yes, cool. Okay, so here, this is like a wire that makes a torque. Look how awesome. That's a two-tone. This is great. This is old. I think this is like deco. All right. And it's a pin pendant. Yeah. That is a good one. I think, yep, one of you just got it. One of you just got it. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, let's see. Oh, the big one. I love the big one. The big money statement. This is their A line. This is a mixture of uh, lengths and chains. Okay, uh, there's a whole bunch of different chains in there. It's got the. It's got that. Um, the fold over. It's so. This is sixties. This is mid sixties. How awesome is that? And look at it on the bus. This is great. This, okay, I feel like this would be great with what I'm wearing. I feel like if I put this on, and you know what, I'll just do it. Because you can see, like, it's, you can see that, how, much, how do I want to say this? This could read as really hip check, right? People might see it as something more old-fashioned or vintage. It's not. It's timeless. All right, hold on. Let me take this back out. And I, the problem is, once I do this, I'm going to want to keep it. That's, that's my problem. That's my problem. Okay, there it is. It's just going to look really cool. Like, total cool girl chic. This is New York. This is Traveler. This is Urban. There you go. I was not kidding. There you go. All right. And it's like already done. It's like layering that you don't have to do. And it's an old Monet. It's not going to change. Like, it's such good quality. Yeah. Tomorrow. New York City girl right there. <laughs> sounds like you know. <laughs> sounds like it takes one to know one, Annie. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah, it's great. It's really, really great. Now, let's see. The little shoe clips. I should highlight these. These are cool. All right. These are Bakelite and cut steel. Put that right there. These are very old. Very, very old. Oops, sorry. Do you guys hear that when I hit the microphone? bad like when I hit the microphone like an idiot like like being awkward and just smashing into it with my hand does that make a big loud sound for you <laughs> hey James <laughs> you know like is, is do I do I do I hurt you by touching the microphone by accident oh I'm so sorry all right I'm really gonna try not to do that I need uh, you know what it is is that I get awkward because it's everything's like backwards and upside down it's a thud. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Here. There they are. That's Bakelite. They're three-dimensional. Okay. 
Bakelite wrapped with cut steel like the way they used to make the old shoe buckles, the old cut steel shoe buckles. So the company that made the cut steel shoe buckles also made Bakelite. There you go. And you could be creative with these. You don't have to use it as a shoe button at all. You could easily, you know, have fun with this and do a dress clip kind of thing or a blazer kind of thing or put it on a purse, you know, something fun. They're just fun little artifacts. They're kind of amazing to find. All right, that came out of Five Acres. And I think I have showed everything. I did. I showed everything. Oh, except for this. This is still here. All right. This came out of my stash. I kept these for a long time. I thought, oh, Maria. Maria, I'm so glad to see you. Okay, Maria. You were asking about a toolkit, right? If you were, will you text me and remind me and I will send it to you? I, I am so sorry. I just want to send you one. And, like, just let me send you one, you know, for everything. And you know, for the relationship, whatever. Um, I think it was you that was asking. Yeah. Okay, so look at this. Oh, yeah. This is old St. John, okay? Escada owned St. John, everybody. It's very nice stuff. It's got the hang tag, big pearls, magnetic, okay? I forget what they used. I think it was 18 karat gold or 20 karat gold plating. There's the ho the hoops that go with it. All right. And that is something you can have both of those St. John with the pouch. Um, this is how it was in her collection. I kept it together. I put it straight into my collection, what I call shopkeeper stash. Um, and now I'm finally letting it go. So there you go. All right. From me to the next person. Not a bad deal either. It's kind of a really good deal for both of those with the pouch. And I think that's everything. Oh, do I have the St. John's available? I, I wanted to show the St. John. I don't think I put them in my list. I will show you these. You can find these in the, uh, in the store. I love these too. All right. So these are just the earrings. I forget how much these were, but you can find them in the store. Also, extremely high-end, high-class. These are forever. All right, easy to wear. All right, and they are signed right there. That's the St. John logo. If you don't know, that's the St. John logo. Okay. Hello, Angela. Okay, so... Oh, you got the, the Monet? Oh, fantastic. Yay, Annie. Oh, I love it when you guys say it. I lo That is so fun for me because I can't tell on my phone who got it. I can just tell that it's gone. Can you tell me anything about the round topaz earrings? The round 14 karat topaz earrings. Uh, uh, did you get them? Are you the one that got them? They're the, the blue topaz, they came from the jewelry store that closed. There was a whole bunch of things. You can find it. Uh, it was the name of the video was $20,000 worth of jewelry. Meet the consigner with me. Right. And it was this girl. She inherited basically a jewelry store that closed in the 80s. And like they started far back because these came from that. Like that whole group of boxes. Right. That all came from the store that closed. And then it was open until the 80s. You did get them. So they're just beautiful, really nice 14 karat studs with blue topaz. I listed several. Uh, I listed the ovals, the princess cut, and the rounds. They're all nice. The princess cuts were my favorite. Those were very good. Those were like, they were all good. But the princess cuts, I don't know why. I just like princess cuts. <laughs> okay. So... There is a great video. Oh, well, thank you, Gail. All right. So how are we going to figure out the giveaway? It's time for the giveaway, everybody. Uh, 
Oh, and the other thing is, uh, as from Wednesday's auction, I uh, I'm I haven't done uh, the labels yet, but they're ready to go. So if you got something from Wednesday's auction and from today, I'll just combine it. All right. So how cool is that? Oh, look at that. The niche lady just uploaded her video. Oh, fantastic. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a giveaway, and then I'm going to link to the niche lady's video. Oh, there you are. She's here. Fabulous. Okay, so let's do a giveaway. Um... I wanted to integrate the new tool, and I didn't do it on this computer. I only did it on the other computer because I'm so smart. It's a doozy! <laughs> Yay! All right. So we will... Okay, so that's going to be the word. Actually, that's going to be the word. If you want to be entered into the giveaway, the word is doozy. D-O-O... -O. Is it Z-I? What is it? Everyone's like, Danny's here. Hey, I didn't get flustered. Oh, so that means I only get flustered on my channel? <laughs> like, what is up with that? Maybe I'm over it. I might be over it. <laughs> I might be over it, finally. <laughs> okay. <laughs> doozy with a Y. All right, the word is doozy with a Y, everybody. So the way this works is I am giving away cash as a door prize because you're here watching tonight. All right. And I will pick a winner randomly, and you will pick one of these envelopes, and you will win whatever is in the envelope that you pick, all right? And the, and the way that you get the money is I PayPal it to you. All right, so everybody enter. I also do cash prizes and, um, on my auctions on Wednesdays, if you don't know, all right? And you can always learn something as well on Wednesdays. If you are, if you haven't been watching, start watching on Wednesdays. If you can, I invite you um, because we have a lot of fun. It's a tight little group. Uh, we're very friendly and um, what are we? Uh, it's a very safe place to be, you know. Uh, none of the toxic shenanigans um, that you can find here on the interwebs. And, uh, and I give away, I give away money and you can learn and you can find jewelry at auction from the videos. All right. So you always learn, says Lauren Lorraine. Yeah. All right. So let's see. Oh, I need my phone. <laughs> I'm like, let's do the giveaway. I have to set it up. Okay. All right. So everybody get in. All right. And this is one of those where it counts as many times as you put it in. You can put it in as many times as you want. All right, and uh, yeah, uh, let's see. All right, get to the comments. We learn, laugh, and drool. <laughs> so true. Oh yeah, okay, I'm picking someone, and it is Galena, Galena G. Galena G, you won. So the next step is, yay, the next step is picking an envelope and you get whatever cash prize is on the inside. All right. And this is how I number them. One, two, and three. One, two, and three. And the reason that they're not numbered is because I mix them up every time I do this. All right. Galena, go tribe. Number one says Meg. Did Galena say that or did Meg say that? <laughs> Galena said one. Okay, all right. So number one. All right, let's see what you got. You got, you got $20, Galena. You got $20. Now, you're on my list, right? I'm pretty sure you're on my tech list already. Uh, if you're not, here, let me put that up. 
if I can find it. Yeah, here it is. The captions. Hold on. All right. If you want to be alerted for sales like this, or when I have an auction, or when I drop a video on Sunday, then text all alerts to 917-809-750 and you will get on the list. You'll also get on the list if you use your real name. You just might get on the list for my invitation onlys. All right, but that's only for people that use their real name that I can tell who they are. Yes, you are on the list. All right, cool. So let me write that down. You got $20. Yeah, James caught it at the very end. He, he showed up at the very end. <laughs> Oh, I'm can wait. Oh yeah, twenty dollars, Galena. Galena. All right. All right. Winner. All right. So I will PayPal that to you. Let me get that in an envelope so I'll process it correctly. All right. This was so fun. Let's all go over and watch the niece lady's uh, uh, video that she just dropped. I want to. That's what I'm going to be doing. All right. Uh, let me go back to the chat. Hi, Carrie. All right. So somebody, uh, somebody, yeah, niece lady, grab your, grab your, uh, you were stuck in another elevator. <laughs> That's brilliant. I don't know why. Everything that comes out of you sounds so poetic. All right. Hi, Kim. All right. Niche. N Danny. Danny, put in put in the link so we can go watch the video. I want to go watch the video. It'll be so much fun. We can all go together, and and uh, read the comments. Yeah. All right. Should we all just go find it, or can you put the uh, whose elevator? I know, really. He's like that. You never know whose elevator it was. Was it on uh, Was it on Fifty Sixth Street? <laughs> Don't you dare! Don't you dare elaborate on that, James. We made an oath. All right, um, she's not putting it in or I don't see it. No, okay, all right, good for you. No, capital no, I know, yeah. All right, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I, I'm sorry. I should not have, it was just for you, James. It wasn't for anybody, nobody else knows. Okay. Oh, and you have a giveaway of Sonia with it too? Fantastic, it's like watching a movie together. All right, well, can you put the, you can't get it in, can you? Should I try? I'll try, Danny. I'm gonna try. I'm so nervous. <laughs> Mod you? Oh, all right, okay. Hold on. Channel report remove, add. Add as moderator, managing moderator, save. Okay, you're modded. I'm glad I'm not the only one, Danny. All right, she's modded. There she's, oh, there you guys go. All right, I'm going to click on it too. I'm going to click on it and start watching. There, all right. And I will, good night, everybody. I love you. Uh, Check out, uh, I'll see you over there at the niche lady's place. Let's go watch the video together. And then Sunday we've got um, Spring Fling. And also my video comes out on Sunday. And uh, thank you so much. We love you. Go, uh-oh. Go find your joy.